Hello and welcome. If you're a gear lover, repairer, or restorer like me, you might have a big bag of capacitors just waiting for your next project. There's a lot of speculation about what brands of caps are best for guitars, amps, or mic preamps, but what's inside those caps? What makes them different from each other? Today, we find out what's inside three of our favorites, the Orange Drop, the Bumblebee, and the Astron Yellow Molded Cap. First, the Orange Drop. These are often referred to as film caps made with metallized polyester. We can imagine what metallized polyester is, but seeing is believing. The first thing that struck me about this cap is how hard the orange casing is. I've worked with many of these caps over the years, and I've always thought the casing was closer to rubber than plastic. I was wrong. The only way to really get this thing open was to finally crack it with a pair of pliers. And here's what's inside. Next up is the Astron. This cap is found in lots of gear from the 1950s and early 1960s. These are famously found in Fender Tweed amps of that era. So, what's inside? I thought this one might be a bit harder to cut open, and I was right. Again, the only way to open it was to use pliers. And here's what's inside.
Finally, perhaps one of the most revered caps of all time, the Sprag Bumblebee. These are often referred to as paper, paper and oil, or foil and oil caps. But what's actually inside? Let's find out. This is paper soaked with oil and thin aluminum foil. I hope this has deepened your understanding about what capacitors really are and what they're made of. If you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell for more. Have you ever used any of these caps? Leave a comment below and let us know your experience. Thanks for watching.